Well, happy Monday, everybody. How are you? It is a fantastic day in Las Vegas. You know, I was uh, talking to uh, uh, an agent who joined my open house yesterday, and she said that um, <clears throat> we are going to have some 100 degree weather here soon again. I didn't uh, I didn't realize that. So, wow, I think Wednesday and Thursday, she said, I thought we were done with that. But anyway, can't complain. We live in a fantastic climate, fantastic, clean city. You know, I'm from the East Coast and the East Coast is old. It's older. Most of it. I mean, not all of it, <clears throat> excuse me, but the major cities are. And they're not as pretty as Las Vegas, I have to tell you. So anyway, uh, happy for everybody to be here today. Um, yeah, that market, it's a slowing down. We're only doing, you know, we're really only doing about um, 78 sales a day. And last year we were doing t almost twice that. So I know that there's a lot of realtors out there that have to be financially hurting, if you will, because you get used to that, you know, uh, business uh, model that you think is going to last forever. And then all of a sudden we get punched in the face a little bit like we did the past couple months with the market shifting. But, you know, the market always does shift. In any event, we have 37 percent of our active homes and the active homes, everybody uh, in uh, single family homes is 7,618. Wow. Now, think about that. That's available here in Las Vegas in the zip codes, not counting Pahrump, not counting Boulder City, not counting Mesquite, just in the greater Las Vegas Valley and Henderson. So North Las Vegas included, of course. Um, and that's a lot of homes. That's a lot of homes. That's a lot of homeowners, a lot of homeowners out there waiting to get their houses sold. And we're only selling, you know, 78 a day um, at the run rate. <clears throat> Sorry, at the run rate of August, which was 89 a day, that gives us 108 days of inventory. Wow, <laughs> that's three months. Excuse me for just a second, water break, water break. Thank you. Anyway, um, 108 days of inventory, and uh, hopefully by the end of this week, we can say that September did 89 a day, but. We'll see. We're at 78 now. And of course, the end of the month is always, you know, the bigger percentage uh, close. And the end of the month happens to be on Friday. This, yeah, Friday is the 30th. So it might, uh, some of those closings, you might not register till Monday. So I probably won't update the September figures till then. We're still at the run rate of 450 medium priced home. And that market is about 37% of the active homes. And we just listed 29 homes 450 and under uh, over the weekend and we've uh for total 94 homes we listed this weekend and the uh million dollar homes uh we have 957 uh of our 7000 of our oops of our actually of our 9683 homes and that's about 10 percent of the market pretty much uh, that has stabled stabilized this year now we were selling uh, five, um, five plus, uh, five homes a day in that million dollar mark. <clears throat> now we're down to about 4.78. So it is slowing down a tad, just a tad though. So those million dollar agents are still um, getting, uh, getting the income that they were getting. Um, well, even throughout last year, Look at last year, 2021, the average daily sales was four and a half. And we're a little bit above that this year at 4.78. So we'll see what happens. Everybody just, uh, you know, it's like we're on a roller coaster. You just, and that's life. That's life's a roller coaster. That's what Steve Martin says. Anyway, uh, the investors are still out there buying the homes. They're buying 35 and 34 a day, went down a little bit, but not much. That's 30% of our market. In any event, um, we don't know uh, what's going to happen in the next couple months. Hopefully, uh, some of the buyers will get off the fence. Hopefully, the sellers will start offering uh, a ten thousand dollar buy down, especially in the meat of the market, uh, to buy down the interest rate because they have equity. You still have equity. Remember that. Remember our chart. People that uh, bought homes at the end of December in twenty twenty. Uh, one, they were paying about three sixty-five to four hundred thousand medium price for their home. 
So when you look at those, uh, <clears throat> all those homes that are on the market in that 450 and under price range, they have equity. So they, they can perhaps give $10,000 away to the buyer so that we can keep the momentum uh, or increase the momentum, I should say, of our market. Um, that is the MLS stats for the day. We'll carefully watch it throughout the week and see how September ends up. And do you believe we're going into the fourth quarter of 2022? And hopefully you have adjusted your business plan. And that means you've adjusted your marketing. When the market slows down, you've got to increase your marketing. Hopefully you have looked at your financial leg of your business and you have adjusted it for the new norm, which is not as many sales. Uh, statistics right here show you that we're 50%. So what you should do is uh, put your income at 50% and see how that's going to play out for the last quarter.